Life Coach D coming at you, and I'm coming at you today with my coach's moment. So I want to talk to you today about knowing who you are as a coach. So in my book here, Being a Leader of Leaders, Effectively Coaching More Than the Athlete, in Chapter 4, I talk to you about knowing who you are as a coach. A lot of times people go into coaching for many reasons, whether it's you have the ability and the talents or whether the particular port, excuse me, sport you're coaching was something that you did in your high school and your college career. And then sometimes you're just there because the staff needs you and, and because you're like an, uh, um, a teacher who's been hired on at the district, they, you're just fulfilling the position. Nevertheless, knowing who you are as a coach is huge because if you don't know who you are, and then you're out there leading in a capacity and you're not you don't know who you are, so it's hard for you to lead other people. And so it's keenly important that you know who you are as a coach. I often tell people what you do is not who you are. And so if you are there as a coach, realize that you're out there in a capacity that you may have talent in. Or like I said, if you're pushed into a situation where you don't necessarily have the talent, and you're just being used, at least do the research that is deemed necessary to be a successful person in that position so that you can lead those that have been given to your responsibility in a perfect way and so that's what i have so just know that it's keenly important that you know all the time who you are and that you're confident in who you are and then your coaching attributes will be manifested in that coach's position so that's what i have that's my coach's moment to you guys here from me again i just remember your lives are very valuable much love god bless and peace be with you